Welcome back. Jumping into October means Halloween candy, costumes, decorations. Yeah, but for some, this also kickstarts holiday shopping, of which I can't believe I'm even saying no. that. Oh, yeah. Does it make you a little sweaty? Yeah, just a little, a little bit. bit. Okay, so it's October 2nd. Have you done any of your shopping? I'll let you answer that in your own head. All right, this is a safe space. <laughs> uh, if you are going to answer no here, same. I am in your boat, but we are in the minority. 53% of people have already started shopping and they will be done by the end of October. Wow. So mm. if you are anything like me and you have an inbox and you are getting inundated with every single reminder that mm -hmm. Walmart deal days are coming up, Prime days are coming up, and Target deal days, I mean, it's on like Donkey Kong, and I just also want to let you all know that it's all next week. So Walmart yeah. kicks off October 8th, their holiday season. They don't have days, but that is essentially whenever the deals are really going to kick off. Amazon has the fall prime days. That would be the 8th and 9th ninth ninth next saw. week. That's yes. 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 That's all two over days. Back. Every time I log in. Yeah. I like, no. oh, I and know. then Target said, I'm sorry, one in two days? No, we're going to do a whole week. So next mm. Saturday, the 6th. Oh, I'm sorry, that's Sunday the 6th, yeah. this Sunday, and it's going until next Saturday the 12th. That's Target Steel Days. They promise, all three of those big retailers promise that this is going to be the best that they've ever had. Yeah. So I will say, if you have Christmas ideas, I would kind of add them to the cart now. Yeah. I know at Amazon, they show you the price decreases in your cart. Don't make any purchases yet. Take advantage of these sales. I love doing that. Mm -hmm. Same, yeah. but I also know that I need to get better about budgeting for holiday gifts. Mm -hmm. I need to uh, uh, not doing it all on December 20th and then paying that insane shipping. Does, do you guys have an approach? I, you know, I don't know if I have an approach, but I, I, I have somewhat of a formula. Like, I do like to spread out my buying because I feel like I'm a very thoughtful gift giver. And I feel like if I try and, like, squeeze everything in at the last minute, the things that I really want for specific people, they'll be gone. Yeah. And then I'll be really mad at myself because I have to give them something that I know that, A, I didn't want to give them and that they probably don't want yeah. anyway. I mean... Yeah, so mm -hmm. I do, I spread it out, I plan it in that manner, and I do a little bit at a, at a time, so it doesn't feel like I'm dropping a whole paycheck. Yeah. yeah. Well, that's, that's what I do. Yeah. Mm -hmm. oh. I know. Well, and I think, I, I don't know what the stat is, but I do think that the majority of people go over their budget Every year, holiday oh, yeah. shopping, and I can't remember what it is, but the National Retail Federation always puts out some really great data around holiday shopping and spending. Um, my approach is, and I started this just a couple of years ago, because having three kids, and all mm -hmm. wanting a lot of stuff on their wish list. Oh yeah. Oh, it they're not asking for dollar store <laughs> stuff. That's no, so weird. not this year. Mm -hmm. Apparently, <laughs> Lululemon, oh, Sol de Janeiro. What is your oh, Sol de Janeiro? Sol de Janeiro. Sol de Janeiro. Yeah. Yeah. Lululemon, Stanley's, all of it. Oh, I'm like, oh. where? What? Don't they want like drunk elephant skincare now? Yeah. Isn't that the thing? With I mean, it's like know? ninety dollars for a moisturizer. <laughs> I I applaud this. I was in an Ulta uh -huh. and I saw a little girl, probably ten who was asking one of the sales reps there at Ulta about um, Drunk Elephant. She was like, oh, honey, you're too young. Good wow, for her. Good. Yeah, she was like, it's going to ruin your skin. Your, so, your skin's the best that. it's ever been. Don't Direct, touch it. Directed them to bubble, which is something yeah. that we've talked mm -hmm. about before. Anyways, I digress. My strategy is on Friday when you get paid, buy a gift. Buy a gift now. Mm. Do it this Friday. Buy one. Okay. Set it aside. Set it aside. Oh, look at that. Every and Friday. Just, every Friday. If you get paid every two weeks, do it then and buy gifts for the kids or a mm -hmm. family member. Do it that day. Just do it that Friday. Yeah. Just remove it and set it aside. I oh. love, I mean, talk then, about responsible. Because mm -hmm. yeah, if you're buying one thing for somebody else, then it's not as big of an impact mm -hmm. as when it's December 14th and you're like, oh my gosh, I have to buy for this person, the bus driver, and the teacher, and I have to get this, and I have to make. Oh my God, I forgot the bus driver. I know. I the, bus driver. <laughs> <laughs> the bus driver. Add that one to okay, your list. Do you have that. a good hiding place? And that's what well, I wanted to do. house. Oh, oh so it's gonna be a fun year, baby. <laughs> yeah. Anyways, lots to think about. Yeah. Do it fine. this Friday. Uh, so